because you love them, but readers, I, I know, have told you that they love them. They're always nagging for another one. Uh, I'm curious Which doesn't you. work, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm <coughs> such a funda fundamentally such a contrarian that, that um, you know, the, the more people tell me I ought to do something, the less inclined I am to. So. You, we just, did, we just a word to the wise. Use reverse psychology. We could say we hope you never come back to study. Yeah. Uh, I'm I'm curious where Scudder came from. Uh, he lived in a hotel, and I understand at one point you lived in a similar hotel or the same. No, hotel? I didn't actually. I was living in a, a studio apartment, but in that neighborhood at at the West time. 57. Yeah, uh, yeah. I was actually around the corner on 58, um, and my agent at the time had suggested that it might be a it might be a good move to develop a series. As I said, this was developed as a series. And he said something about a tough cop. He said uh, there were no more, they weren't going to be doing Carter Brown anymore at Signet or something like that. So the opportunity for a tough cop action series uh, existed, maybe. And uh, so I, I thought about that. And I realized that much as I enjoyed reading Evan Hunter's uh, Ed McBain books, the 87 Precinct now, as much as I enjoyed police procedural when, it, when it's done well, I had no interest in, in learning all of that, that crap, let alone uh, uh, trying to, to write it and all. I, I, I wasn't interested in that. It sounded like too much work, for one thing. Anything that sounds like too much work, I have made it my business to steer clear of over the years. I, I didn't become a writer because I, I wanted to do a lot of, of heavy lifting. And um, I, I also realized that writing from the point of view of a functioning member of a uh, presumably functioning bureaucracy, i.e. the police department, would not really work for me. But I, I, I didn't think I could get that right. And I, so, so I decided that, uh, that my hero ought to be an ex-cop, and probably something of a burned out case. And that's where Scudder came out.